It's an athlete's ultimate honor, the retirement of his jersey number. And in Los Angeles and Boston, the honor list is of Hall of Fame caliber. Above the Boston Parquet, number six, Bill Russell, defensive intimidator non Perel. And in the Forum Heights, number 13, Wilt Chamberlain, the Lakers' giant on offense. The Celtics, 14, Bob Cousy, whose spectacular ball handling was a precursor of the playmaking magic we enjoy today. In the Forum hangs number 44, Jerry West, the Lakers' reliable Mr. Clutch. John Havlicek's number 17 is answered by Elgin Baylor's number 22. The Boston Green, number 18, retired to honor Dave Cowens. And the Lakers, number 33, celebrates the contributions of basketball's greatest score. In the 1990s, there are two more places on reserve. In the crowded rafters in Boston, a spot for number 33, the blonde bomber from French Lick, Indiana, Larry Bird. And here in Los Angeles, Bird's longtime rival, the peerless playmaker, Irvin Magic Johnson. Two names, married in basketball brilliance. Two men who brought new quality, a new life to the entire NBA. Two men who either separately or together have appeared in all but one NBA final since entering the league in 1979. Today, one awaits the end of a career in the East, while the day of honor has arrived here in the West. Last week, he punctuated the end of an NBA career, which could not have been better scripted on a Hollywood movie set. And now joining the Lakers elite, number 32, the number, retired. The man, magic, earning his supreme and untimely farewell. This is the NBA on NBC.